this talk today and in the next very few moments, I invite you all to join me in the journey that we explore the essence of leadership and the true ingredients behind those trailblazers, the incredible individuals who are willing to, dare to, and are able to blaze any trails in this world. So firstly, let's look at what is trailblazer and what, what it takes to become a true trailblazer. A trailblazer is to be a pioneer, an innovator, who then to dream big and take bold changes and bold steps to work the future. It means breaking free from the constraints of convention and dare to chart your own path. At the heart of every trailblazer, there are three core qualities. First, you need a vision. A vision helps you dream big, inspire others to join you in the journey of making changes to the world. But you can't just have just vision. You need strategic thinking. You need to know what you're doing, how you're going to do it. You've got to find your way being strategic. And lastly, there will be moments, right, that you see obstacles, you have challenges that stop you from doing what you're doing. And that's when you need an unstoppable spirit. And for me, that's the three most important qualities that make you become a true leader, a true trailblazer. In short, a trailblazer is the fearless leader who inspire others to believe in themselves, strive for greatness. By embracing these qualities, we can all unlock your inner trailblazing ability and create a better world for all of us. That's what it is. Now how you, how you do it, how you become a true trailblazer. So very fast, out of three qualities, you need to begin with a vision. I'm standing here with you all today as somebody who is lucky enough to have at some point blazed my own trails. And one of the most significant trails that I've blazed would be how I secured an Oxford scholarship to study education in Oxford. And what makes me a little bit more proud is how I am the only Vietnamese student there actually the only Vietnamese student at the whole entire department of education. And the professor also told me that I am the only Vietnamese student for the last 10 years, for the last whole decade. There's no Vietnamese people there. I think that's what the chills that I've placed. And this whole journey, this whole accomplishment all starts with a vision. How I, you know, I, I still remember the day when I remember standing in front of the mirror. Imagine the moment that I walk into the grand halls of Oxford. Around me are the colleagues and friends uh, from all over the world who are excellent at what they're doing, going into all these lecture theatres. And I also imagine how I accept the offer letter. And I can imagine the happy faces of my parents. And really that one moment, that one vision filled my determination push me to achieve something that one seems for me is impossible. For me, vision is a vital ingredient of becoming a true trailblazer. To create something extraordinary, you must dare to imagine your success. You find yourself settling for something simple, something ordinary, and you're going through day by day not wanting something strongly, you're selling yourself short. And remember, every great achievement starts with a single idea, a flicker of imagination that ignites the flames of ambition. Remember, the whole journey that you go all starts with one single step, right? Wherever how far you go, wherever how long you go, everything starts with one single step. So my first message for today, dream big. If there's something you think you can do but beyond your reach, close your eyes and you envision the moment it becomes your reality. Allowing yourself to entertain these possibilities, you are already taking the very first step to what realizing them. That first. Second, many people get stuck at that stage where you simply wanted something. We all want something, yeah? But wanting something, wanting to blaze a trail doesn't actually blaze any trail. You need to take action. Right? But you can't just, oh, I want this, I'm just going to walk around, see where it leads to, right? So, endless 
see wandering around doesn't lead you to any success. Or actually it might, by luck. It's not really up to your decision. So I think the second very important point is that you need to be very strategic in what you do. Now let's come back to our fundamental question. Do you need to be smart in order to be a trailblazer? The answer is yes. You kind of need to be smart. But smart in here, as in, S, in specific goals. M, measurable plans. A, achievable objective. R, relevant targets. And T, time-bound milestones. And this smart approach has actually played a significant role in helping me achieving the Oxford journey. So I set a very specific goal. I need this scholarship at this major, in this department, at Oxford University. And to achieve this, I decided to start talking to professors, I find out what the school needs, what kind of students they're looking for, what would make them feel that I am a suitable candidate that makes them, that force them to, to choose me. Right, so that being very specific being measurable, being relevant. And in my application, I made sure that I showed the, the people that I could contribute to the university. And connecting the dots, making everything so relevant, making them say yes, it was as if the universe guided me towards my goal. Being smart like this also helped me achieve other and blaze other trails in life. So when I went back to Vietnam, Knowing that I wanted to pursue a PhD, I decided to start working at the research institute because I know that the shortest way, so that's the M in SMART, measurable. And, that, and then I started working at the institute, just focusing on publication to make sure that I can achieve my final goal of applying a PhD. And within one year, I became the youngest PI, so principal investigator in the history of the law at Ministry of Education and Training. So finally, the second, I firmly believe that with the right plan and a smart approach, everything is possible. Lastly, even sometimes when you have a clear vision and you have a very well laid well plan, you know exactly what you want to do, there are moments of weakness. There are moments that things starting to feel wrong. There are moments when you feel like the whole world is turning against you, is turning their backs on you, they don't support what you do. So you must remember the very last but also very important ingredient to success is that there's no easy obstacle free path to success. And therefore, you have to be unstoppable. You have to keep this unstoppable mindset that nothing is impossible. Obstacles will come along the way. They may hurt you, it may discourage you from doing what you want to do, it's essential to keep moving forward. Believe that with the right mindset, the right tools, the right companions, people around you, there's nothing that you can do. There's nothing, literally. So when you're on the verge of keeping up, I want you to stop there for a while, look back on the whole journey that you've gone, look at your current step, to see where you are and keep moving forward. Yeah? One step by step. Not ten steps, not five steps, just one step at a time. So reflecting on my own journey, and this is the, also the last key message that I want to tell you. If I decided to be given up back when I was in Melbourne when I got rejected for nine teaching jobs, I would never become a teacher I am today, an educator, or an inspirer. If I had settled for a steady job when I went back to Vietnam three years ago, I wouldn't have ended up at Oxford. If I also compromised with such a great offer to work in London, I would not have come back to Vietnam. It's very slowly made changes to the lives of many students around me. So I think life is all about making small but bold decisions, daring to keep moving forward no matter what happens, no matter how many challenges lie ahead of you. And this unstoppable mindset is a crucial aspect of a trailblazer's attitude. So ladies and gentlemen, as we come to the conclusions of our time, let's reflect on the key points, the key insights I want to send you today. Very briefly, 
First, what it means to be a trailblazer. And second, how to become a trailblazer. Trailblazers are pioneers today to dream big, to be with vision, and to take bold steps to create changes. And to become a true trailblazer, you must remember the three essential qualities. Being visionary. Dream about what you want to do. Imagine your success. Being smart. As in, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time bound. And also, cultivating an unstoppable mindset. So, as we come to the very end of the talk, let's carry on our lessons. And I want you all to think about how you will become a trailblazer for yourself. You know, a trailblazer journey may be long and difficult for any of us, but remember that the real work to blazing a new path is immeasurable. You become believing in yourself a little bit more every day, and that would be the attitude to somebody who would change the world. So, thank you for joining me on the explorations of attitude to mindset to trailblazers. And I wish that as you embark on your own path, you might find your courage, the determination, and the strength to become truly unstoppable. And you are all trailblazers. Thank you so much. Thank you.